Oh, it's a 3x3. Three three. That's, that's a huge one. I don't think I've seen that one before. Or have I? Because I've been using these. Because if we put that here, then we can fit another uh, sm small house here. Or a small house. <laughs> Because if we put that here, for instance, we can have double of these bigger ones. I'm not going to unlock this, but double of those. Uh, we would have platforms. And so they would need to get up here. And I don't have anything planned here. Well, actually, we can have food storage there. Uh, storage up here, I think. Don't remember what I would was going to put here. Bum, bum, bum. Like so. And now we need to store this somewhere. We are going to have the dynamite operation over here. But we do need... Bad water, but we do need... I don't know what I was supposed to say. Metal. There we go. Right before closing time. <laughs> no! Right before a drought! Oh my goodness! What we are going to need is um, actually dynamite. And I think this would be a good idea to have... Have dynamite in that one instead. They can start to move in on this side. Uh, we can wait with the other side. Let them build that one. Ah, oh, a raid! And uh, audio isn't working for it. Hiya! <laughs> Thank you for the raid! Yeah, sitting here debating with myself how to do things. Yeah, I, I really want to start working on this area. Um, I only have vague ideas and that's dangerous. <laughs> 2.7 days to go and I, I don't have anything specific for them to do, that's the thing. I, I want them to work on something. But maybe it's a good idea that they don't work on anything, because we depleted our wood yesterday. We had like... I think we went down to like 30. We're up at 250-ish. So that's nice. Unlock this. Finally! Finally! Um, you are going to be upset because I am going to destroy this. I'm sorry. Whoopsie. Ah, the flow of water. Um, you know, the pressure and that sort of thing. We had an incident yesterday over here uh, that just proved that I... I know nothing! <laughs> uh, to quote Miguel in the faulty towers. Me and water flow. We are not friends. It seems to change. I don't know if that's a... It seems to be a new thing. Like the flow. It's not constant. Yeah, look at this. Now 1200. It was down to 900 before. It goes up and down and I don't really know why. Yeah, let's have a third wheel. Sounds weird, but yeah. It's a path, yes. Bum, 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 ba -da -ba -da -bum, bum. 
let them build that one dynamite. What do we want to do with one dynamite? I always forget that, that we have to unlock first the the building and also the actual dynamite. I'm not too fond of what's going on back here. Platforms here. We could put that wheel up here and then we could connect it to that one. And then we would have stairs. Uh, so if we were to do, say, this... So if we would have to do that and then have a single one. I built these prior to everything else. And I did have the idea of moving them, but then I started to build this and felt like, oh, but we do need a space back here in order to get power lines working. And I, I want to cover it, but I, I also don't want to cover it because just covering. I want, I, I want it to have a meaning, I guess. And in a way, it does have meaning to have the wheel up there. It is a backup. Because the whole battery thing is far ahead, and so, I mean, you know what, let's build it. Why not? <laughs> so indecisive. I can have um, like a vague idea of what I want, but I always have to rely on, you know, the development. Okay, if I do this, what can I do next? Um, I don't see the whole picture. Some other people might do that. I don't. What do you want, Picasin? What? What do you want? I heard meowing. Oh, wait, wait. Groomies. They can be nice to each other. They are so cute. Oh, thank you, Becca Scene. Huh? Thank you. <laughs> it doesn't happen too often, but yeah, you were nice. If Becca Scene's, he senses. I don't know how, but he senses when I touch the camera. So he's like wide awake and like <gasps> meowing, meowing, meowing. And uh, as as if they are going to get treats. So there are things I can't do. Um, I know the microphone doesn't pick it up. The current meowing is really nice and cute, but both of them can turn into these, you know, screaming maniacs with meows that I absolutely detest. Those annoying meows trigger me like no nothing else. He has this annoying belly meow. And then the other one, who is currently standing up on camera, or well, that's Mokasin. He has the absolute worst meow I have ever heard. His standard is like a drawn out squeaky toy. And just imagine you sitting concentrated, doing something. It's quiet, you may, might, have, might have music, but most likely not. Someone steps on a squeaky toy. It freaks me out. He has startled me so many times with his meow. And he can become very demanding as well, especially when he's in the wheel. It drives me nuts. Okay, Bekasin has relaxed. I wonder if I can turn the camera a little bit. <laughs> See if there's a cat. That uh, sort of. Two cats on cats for a price of one cat cat. Oh yeah! Brain freeze! Now we do have fourth time I'm going to say, oh we have dynamite, let's use it. No, because we haven't unlocked it. Like so. And then we do 
the stairs. Then we do the double. Haha, <laughs> look at this! Woo! <laughs> Nice! I like this. <laughs> Wait, are you... Oh, you work at the district center. Wait, do the beavers at the... Oh, they do! <laughs> I was going to... Don't take this the wrong way, and this is going to be so weird now that I think about it. I was going to say that, oh, the beavers have strap-ons. <laughs> uh, yeah. <sighs> These, I didn't, th I didn't think they had... Well, their tools. <laughs> uh, sp speaking of that, um, I don't... I hope no one is, like, prude or anything. It's not that... We, we don't... I don't know, normally talk about certain things. I can allude to something. So there's Carrie Lake, but she was standing in front of people outside talking. She was going to say something to the effect of put the seat belts on and, you know, hard hats and that sort of thing. And she said, oh, we need to strap on, we need to strap on. What do we strap on? <laughs> what are you saying? What are you talking about? And then someone said, you know, seat belt. Oh yeah, we're going to strap on the seat belt. And strapping on a Glock. Are we going to strap it both at the front and the back? And I was like, oh my god, stop it. Naturally, people picked this up and uh, made fun of her on Nine. Nine. Yay! Woo! Woo! Boom. <laughs> Mangroves! There we go. 